I'm Joss, I'm a buyer at Snow & Rock, and we're out here in sunny Nucluza testing skis so that we can bring you the best possible range. So I've been testing the Sender 94 Ti, which is an all-mountain ski from Rosignol. This ski is going to be really well suited to kind of strong intermediates right the way up to advanced skiers or even slightly lighter weight expert skiers. At 94 underfoot, it's going to have a really good platform for, for fresh snow or soft snow, while still being nice and manoeuvrable on piste and fast edge to edge. When I first got this in my hand, I was surprised at how lightweight it is. And that's partly due to the air tip that Rosy, Rosignol uses. What that is, is a slightly milled out tip, which helps to reduce that weight and also make the ski nice and maneuverable. Considering that lightweight of the ski, I was really impressed with how well it held a turn and how well it did at cutting out vibrations. That's partly thanks to the tightenal beam that runs through the ski and especially underfoot, it feels nice and solid. So when you're going through your turns, you have that confidence to really drive the ski. Because of its lightness, it felt really maneuverable in moguls and choppy snow especially. It's got a relatively stiff tail, which really helps to give great confidence as you're exiting your turn. It also helps to kind of give you a little burst of energy while you're, you're exiting your turn, which is a really nice sensation in, a, in an all-mountain ski like this. So as is the case with lots of light skis, the place where this ski possibly struggles a little bit is in that kind of choppy, variable snow, if, especially if you're going to be skiing fast and aggressively through that. If you're the type of skier that likes to just plow through, ski, uh, through snow conditions like that, rather than making quick, agile turns, you might be better suited to look at something like the, the Salomon Stance 96 or the Vocal M6 Mantra. Both of those skis are a little bit heavier and have got a little bit more um, suspension when you're, you're moving through that kind of snow at higher speeds. Alternatively, if you're a heavier guy or a more aggressive skier looking for a really strong, powerful ski, you might be better suited to one of those other skis that I mentioned earlier. If you're the type of skier that likes to really be nimble and agile on the snow though, the Sender 94 Ti is going to be right up your alley. So the Sender 94 Ti comes flat without a binding. What that means is that you're going to have loads of great options from our range at Snow & Rock to mount on this ski. What I'd recommend is probably a Marker Griffin or if you're a little bit lighter, a Marker Squire. So I've currently got this ski in a 178. It's probably a little bit small for me. At my height, which is 6'2", I'd probably be skiing the 186. Ideally, you're looking for kind of nose to above head height with this kind of ski. If you're ever unsure though, pop into one of our Snow & Rock stores and our experts will be able to guide you along your way.